My name is Helen MacDonald and I am a tattooist living in Belfast, Northern Ireland. And I dabble in all sorts of, I don't know, all sorts of activities, whether it's setting up the black market here in Belfast, so. Would you say that men and women are equal in this society? Uh, no, but I might change my mind tomorrow and say yes to that. I think that women definitely have to prove themselves more. And within the tattoo industry, it is very much a men's club. You either have to kind of act like a man in some senses, which I, I just don't want to play that game. I, there was no other women tattooing in Ireland at the time I started. And so I did have to face every day people kind of coming into the shop and going, oh, are you making the tea and that kind of thing. So I, I did end up having a bit of a feisty attitude. Um, and. In all honesty, I would have been quite shy, but this ha I had to bring myself out of that and be more confident with people. And I think that has been a good thing. It's a good quality. Although I don't want to play the whole ego game, you still have to be confident in yourself as well. And I think women lack that a lot, which is really unfortunate. We don't get that platform. You can get patronized quite a lot, where you can be a token female and you're not respected for what you do. It's just that you're a token female involved in certain scenes. And that's irritating. And I don't like having to defend myself all the time, whereas men just seem to walk straight into their little men's club, you know, mm -hmm. all the time. But I have to say that I've been lucky in a lot of places that I've been where, where people are a lot more accepting, I would suppose, because I have been involved in a lot more underground scenes. It's not been the normal going to art college, going straight into kind of a gallery situation or anything mm -hmm. of that. I'm much more of the belief of, of you generate these things yourself. You, um, I'm much more in the view of a DIY ethic, and I think that goes across with male and female. Do you think male versus female clients, that it's heavily skewed one way or another? No, I think women are becoming a lot more open to, to body art. For years, women have been told not to mark their bodies and to be more precious about mm -hmm. it. And I think that's definitely been a stigma that we've all had from a young age. Uh, but, but society is changing a lot and they're respecting it more as a body art so reflective of that, women are actually getting more tattoos and they're seeing it more as an artwork rather than something that you have to be heavily covered and it's a macho idea so there's a lot more creativity happening which, are, which is fantastic because of the economic, the political everything to do with the situation here in Northern Ireland it's reflective on society here women are, are, tend to be very strong here but tend to be very strong in the home and, it, and, and it's great to see women expressing themselves more but Ireland is an island, and, and, and that has to be taken into consideration, that things happen slowly here. And it, I think it's changing for the better, but we still have a long way to go.